Hey guys, it's Brenda from my wee Reaper's Cradle. I just came in from outdoors. It's cold. The winter is officially here in northern Canada. I'm just showing you up above. Let's see if you can see the roads. Yes, the pure ice. There's one section turning left near the train tracks in town and oh my gosh it's horrible it's horrible horrible slipping and sliding it's crazy so i will share with you like i used to always share with you the um how come the angle looks weird to me but it's minus 20 degrees outside which is actually not bad i'm not sure what it is with the wind chill but it's pretty chilly in the house is 20 degrees celsius now in fahrenheit that would be minus four degrees fahrenheit outside and 68 in the house <laughs> so yes it's chilly chilly um i came back from moving my son to where my other son is so my two sons are going to be roomies so that's exciting i'm thinking oh i hope they don't argue too much but they get along very well and i'm very proud of both of them they're both young adults uh my middle son turned 18 in august and he was on his own in a nearing town and it didn't pan out so now he's with his brother in the city down south it's still in the same province but i just traveled back yesterday and the weather down south is so nice compared to up here although i heard that they're also getting cold and i feel like i'm rambling at 20 miles per hour <laughs> but i i was able to go to the thrift store in the city i'm so excited um i refrained so much you guys so much i went to the walmart i went to um a thrift store i went to another it's called the superstore canadian superstore and oh my goodness they had lots of things on sale <laughs> it's a lot cheaper in the city for products and uh groceries is cheaper gas is cheaper the roads are super nice but the thing that I'm not used to is um, the traffic lights took forever to turn. I'm sitting there for like two minutes. I'm like, what? <laughs> the traffic lights in my town are never that long. And another thing is waiting in line at the tail. Oh my goodness. Waiting in line for five, ten minutes. Like what? This is crazy. In my town, uh, when I go shopping, there's maybe six other people in the whole entire store that's it so i'm glad to be home but i wanted to share with you a few things i got at the thrift store and i did order a couple of things online from walmart so sorry about all my rambling you're not seeing anything right now except for this but this is a blanket i got from the thrift store i really really like it it's kind of like a um a quilted kind and it was only and this is canadian money too by the way 250 canadian so inexpensive i couldn't pass it up and it's so cute i love all these cats and it's winter too which is winter where i live last for six months of the year so a good six months even maybe a bit more um, I bought this from Walmart online. These are good starch nipples. Uh, the thing is, I do own, like, these these glass ones. Um, I got them in the mail a few years ago, and I love them. And I did have, like, this is from one of these. So I just put it on here. But I love how these are white so they could be for my girls so i have one for my boys blue and one for my girls and i love that these are cute little glass they're i can't see without my glasses they're 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 tiny they're just extremely newborn size so, so i love these glass bottles um i think i gifted one away 
um, and I gifted many of these. I still have lots of these even unopened. <laughs> this is probably disgusting. The stuff inside is so old. But let's move on. So I'm excited for those. I did buy this from online Walmart online. They were on sale. Um, but I I love these. It's their final um, receiving blankets, and I thought that I love this this design. This one is what sold me on it. I don't own anything foresty. Well, I shouldn't say that. I do, but. I don't own this. So I love it. And I love the rest of them too. But now this is the the object, the whole thing of this whole video. I'm so excited. I have no idea what these will fit. These are doll clothes. Now I do have a couple of mini silicones and I do have some fairies. And I do have, like, Carly's doll. Carly is, I'll just pan you over. Try not to go too fast. Carly is sitting over here. And she has, she has this, this is her, this is her little doll. So I'm not sure. Maybe they'll even fit the, this, this doll too. Are you in a weird one? Okay, I have to check what... Seem like you're in wide lens. Maybe you're not. <laughs> you were not in wide lens. Wow. <laughs> I guess I'm not used to see I never did a video in a long time. Okay, my knee is in the way. Don't mind my knee. <laughs> but this bag of clothes, I'm so excited. I never opened it. But I kind of did a quick pan. And I love what I see on the outside. Let's see what they are on the inside. And this bag was $5.99. Canadian, which is not bad. And this one, I noticed that there's a fur, something fur in here. So I also picked this one up. And that was $4.99. So let's do this small one. I'm so excited. Okay. So, and I don't even know what sizes these are really, but... I'm sure I have baby lives, I have this size, I have my fairies, so I'm sure that these will fit something. <laughs> See, here's some shorts. This might be, I wonder if these are baby life. There's a little, I wonder if these are boy, little boy shorts. Swim trunks. Oh, this is cute. Look at this. It's the top. I wonder if these are for baby lives. I wonder if she can even fit them. And by the way, this doll is a drink and wet system as well. You could feed her a bottle and put diapers on her. And she's softer. Like, she actually has um, a stomach that you push down. This 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 fits her, and I'm excited to see if these can fit my my um. They might be too big for my mini silicones, but you never know. So sorry, I'm just trying to, and I'll probably wash all of these too. Use my baby laundry soap. <laughs> I love my baby laundry soap. So what's this? Oh, this is a a pant with a skirt attached. It's cute. Oh, sleeping. If you recognize any of these clothes, please let me know. Like, are they for AG dolls? I kind of recognize these from, like, I recognize this. A top, some little panties, underwear. 
It was a hair band. Oh, this is a Lola, a Lola Bell band. I also own those. A Lola Bella and a Lola Bow. Oh, these are cute little slippers. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is cute. I love it. It's a hat. That is so cute. I love this. Oh my goodness. Wonder if I can fit. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love it. That's cute. I love it. Okay, what's ooh, these are like brand new still. Two dollars for these. Pointails. Ooh, they're so soft. So that was the first thing in here. Oh well. <laughs> Oh, this is a cute little purse. It's cute. Ooh, this is a shirt. I don't know what kind of shirt. What does this say? I can't tell. Some sort of doll brand. It's cute though. It's a blouse. How's this on the bottom? It's cute. There's some more pants. Cute. And this is just hers. This is a baby so real. And I also bought her like accessories, like bottle accessories, but Anyways, yay, so that was the one bag. I'm very excited. I see lots of cute things in there. Now, let's do this bag. <laughs> oh, I love surprises like this. This is a good thumbnail, by the way. Let me see what I can do. Okay, <laughs> that was my thumbnail. Okay, ooh, these are big long pants. These look like those BJD dolls, maybe? Or those LOL tall dolls? Those are long pants, oh my goodness. Oh, this is a cute hat. Look. Have to fit her too. I don't, sorry, I know I'm trying on all these things, but... Oh, it's a little big on her. <laughs> cute, though. I like it. It's cute. Ooh, this is pretty and stretchy. Wow. This material is like a muslin blanket. Like, so stretchy. It's the same. I don't know what, what sort of doll this is for. But yeah, if you guys know what kind of doll would fit these, like what they're supposed to be for, that would be great. I would love to know. But of course, I'll put them on whatever fits, right? <laughs> oh, here's a blanket. I think um, the Lava Bella or the Baby Alive, like... The robot one that I also own, Baby So Real or something. Oh, this is cute. This is a bigger one. This could fit in preemie. Like, it's even big for her, yeah. This cute, oh, sorry. Even a cabbage patch type. Oh, I love this. It's so cute. Look. I love it. <laughs> it's a pajama set, but I love the print on it. It's cute. Ooh, here's another pretty one. Look at this. Flamingo dress. Actually, it's a top. But it has a tool all around it, like a ballerina. Oh, so pretty. Oops. Oh. Okay, these are more of those really tall pants. They look like, I don't know, for, or even, I think they might be for those LOL tall dolls. 
the big ones. Okay, this looks like a funky 70s style pants. Ooh, this one's nice. This is a whole set. This one's a pajama set. I love this one. Look at this vintage style. It's even the material is like vintagey. I love this. There. I wonder if that'll fit a preemie, one of my preemies. I love that. Ooh, here's another top. Oh, it has a kitten on it. Yeah, I'll probably wash these for sure. But that's cute. I like it. Ooh, this is a hat. A, a homemade, I think. Or oh, it's a Barbie crochet dress. Oh my goodness, so pretty. Wow. It's like a Barbie. See, it's Barbie spaghetti strings. That's pretty. I don't have any dolls for this one, though. Ooh, some more of those big, long pants. <laughs> Same thing, but it looks like there's, like, a saddle. Like, um, one of those... Actually, this body is wider. Interesting. Here's uh, another underwear. Or cover, diaper cover. I probably just assume underwear. I think this is one. And one more. No, that's it. I thought this was in the bag. And that's it. So, <laughs> so news guys, thank you so much for joining me. I look tired. Um, my, my sons, they both have cats. And I'm allergic to cats. And apparently Jeremy's cats, they really love me. <laughs> so they're like all over. I'm just recuperating from my allergies. Oh, and <laughs> it's so funny. The first morning I woke up after being surrounded by cats because um, my middle son's place before that I moved him also had cats. And there was cat, like, everywhere cat stuff everywhere and that one morning i woke up and i look in the mirror and i'm like oh my goodness my eyes they look slightly glassy they look swollen a bit <laughs> and my first thoughts were oh my goodness what did the what did the jab do to me <laughs> crazy it's allergies i'm pretty sure it's allergies so today I'm just resting it, trying to recuperate. I'm washing all my laundry, trying to get rid of all the cat hair if I like from my luggage, um, everything. And today I'm just taking it easy. I do have allergy medication, so that's good. But I really wanted to see what was inside these bags. So thank you guys for sharing the moment with me. Hope that you're doing well. Thank you to all my new subscribers too. I see I have a lot of new subbies, so welcome. And I hope that you guys are having a great day. And until next time, bye guys. And much hug guys. Much hug. Love you. High five me guys. Love you guys. Until next time. Bye. Bye for now.